right, everybody. Give Mike a round of applause. Did you see him? He picked me up. Give him a, yeah, he didn't even use his hands. Soak it in, everybody. I'm three foot, three inches tall. That's right, I got a body like a chihuahua, a pit bull personality, but I got an ass like a corgi. I have a form of dwarfism. If we have any fans in Little Pimp of Big World, I have the same type of dwarfism as Matt Roloff. It's a recessive gene. What that means is two tall people created this. Yeah, that's right. I was born in Thompson, Manitoba, Canada, 1970. Both my parents are tall. My mom was a school teacher. My dad was a bush pilot. It was 1970, so my mother had a huge bush. <laughs> yeah. Each type of dwarfism has their own genetic makeup. I like using the, the Roloff family. You're familiar with Little People Big World. Amy Roloff has the most common type of dwarfism. It's called achondroplasia. It's a dominant gene. Matt Roloff has my type of dwarfism, diastrophic. It's a recessive gene. The two of them had four kids, one of which has dwarfism. He had the dominant gene like uh, Amy Roloff. Well, diastrophics, the thing is, is our proportions are different. There's over 400 different types of dwarfism, right? You guys don't realize that? Yeah. They all have their own physical characteristics. My proportions are all off and it throws things into the works. I get into situations, people are like, do you write material? No, I live material. I was flying on an American Airlines flight from uh, Huntsville, Alabama down to Florida. I drive a scooter, a three-wheel mobility scooter. That, it's my car, I drive it to the door of the airplane. I get off. Got my friend Patty with me, she grabs the bags. So we walk onto the airplane, say hi to the flight attendant, right? We're sitting in the bulkhead, the front row. So I got my little step stool, I get up onto it, kick it uh, uh, under the seat in front of me, and I'm sitting there beside Patty and we're chatting. All of a sudden, the flight attendant comes over and she goes, excuse me, ma'am, is your seat FAA approved? And immediately I thought, oh, of course, the seat of my scooter, right, obviously. And she was like, no, 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 the seat you're sitting on. And I was like, well, I'm on an airplane seat. I hope it's FAA approved. Why are you asking me? Didn't you go to some training for this shit, right? And then she doubles down like I'm the asshole, right? And she goes, no, the seat you're sitting on. And that's when I went, my ass? <laughs> Did you just ask me if my ass was FAA approved? <laughs> right? So picture, if you will, right? A dwarf and a tall chick walking onto an airplane. Sizable height difference, right? But when we sit down, we're eye to eye. Right? So, when the flight attendant came over, she thought I was sitting on a booster seat. So when I showed her it was my big fat ass, she was like, nine, 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 nine. She started twitching, smoke coming out of her ears, can't compute, can't compute, right? And at first I was like, oh my God, I'm getting ass shamed. Woo! But then I realized, oh my God, it's happened again. Right? It's not my first rodeo, been in this body a long time, right? Normally it happens at Chinese food restaurants. I walk in, they see me, oh, you need a booster seat? You need a booster seat? I'm like, I'm good. No, you're tiny, you're tiny. You need a booster seat? I'm like, I'm good, right? Then I sit down, they're like, how'd you do that? <laughs> Every time, right? This was the same situation, just different location, right? So I was like, oh my God, I had to make a video. Of course, I had to make a video, put it out there, right? I put it out there. Some people are like, she should be fired. How dare she, she should be reprimanded. I'm like, really? I'm a firm believer that being offended is a choice, you guys. Being offended is a choice. I, if I was offended every time dumb, some dumbass said something to me, I'd never leave the house. And to prove I have a great sense of humor, you guys, I got a brand new tattoo on my left ass cheek that's a stamp that says FAA approved. <laughs> Thank you guys, I'm Tanya Lee Davis. Enjoy the rest of the show, thank you.